Hello, welcome to Raiders Test Kitchen. Today we're going to be making a salmon spread, something that you can put on crackers. You can have it in a little bowl for a, a small get together and people can spread it on toastinis or pita chips or whatever, really. Um, for our ingredients list, we have a uh, garlic salt, um, Neufchatel or cream cheese, some really good home uh, smoked salmon, some sour cream, some fresh parsley, some fresh dill. Real simple. We could uh, we can add, you know, citric acid, lemon juice. Uh, we can add many different things, but we're trying to keep it as simple as possible because the flavor is going to really come out from the salmon and the dill. So we'll go ahead and get started by whipping this together. We'll put the cream cheese in there. Try to let it come down to room temperature so it's nice and soft. This one's still a little cold, but no big deal. We have our sour cream. If you have a mixer, you can do it uh, in the mixer, or you can do it by hand. Okay, I got about 80% incorporated there, but I want to be able to continue to whisk it with the salmon in there. I'm going <clears> to <throat> chop up my herbs real quick, just kind of a fairly rough chop. Dill really sets it off. The parsley does add flavor, really adds good color to it too. Okay, the salmon. This one in particular has some skin on it. We can put the we can put the skin in there, which is totally fine. We're just going to take that out. Simply peel, peel, pull it off here. It's firm, so to give it kind of an assist to uh, breaking it up in that. In the bowl, we're just going to chop it up a little bit. It's definitely important to use quality salmon uh, or quality smoked salmon. Um, if you were to go out and buy the lower end stuff, um, what I do is I try to dry it out in the oven <clears throat> because it's kind of packaged in a moisture like a, a wet contents whether it's oil or liquid like a saline solution or some sort <clears throat> this reminds me of my childhood all right the Really, what I think a really good important part is, is adding some garlic salt to it. Bring out that flavor, add some savory to it. Actually gonna, gonna add some fresh garlic to it too. All right. Yeah, that's really good. Super simple. I didn't add citric acid because the sour I'm getting from the sour cream, which would be nice, but it's so nice how it is. 
this is very delicate so but I'm gonna go ahead and some people start out by making the base last but I make it first I go about there and then I start pulling it down to the side this is a very ripe tomato very delicate you can almost peel that skin off keeping that knife sawing back and forth applying pressure as needed And this point right there, you want at the edge of your skin. That's what I'm focusing on. So, oh, fell off. Okay. So, then what we do is we just twist it up. So I made the salmon spread, uh, did a little rose here for a garnish with a little bit of fresh dill. You can serve it like this in a bowl. Um, you can spread it, smear it onto either some toast or some bread of some sort and just kind of serve it like that. We can take a little bit and serve it with crackers just like so. But this is a very simple, delicious dip. It's good for having some get together, some friends over or just for, you know, a little appetizer for the family. So I hope you enjoy. Give us some feedback. Let us know. Thank you for watching.